Hi Glencoe, I'm Allie Hedges. Now, I'm aware that leadership has a stereotype associated with it, and I'm tired of it. People think that we have had everything in our life handed to us and that we're perfect, but actually that is not the case at all. My life has been very difficult. My mom had me when she was a teenager, and oftentimes we were so poor that we were eating out of food kitchens, and my school had to give us food just so we had something to eat for dinner. I'm here to prove that you can make anything out of your life if you want to. I now am an A student, a varsity athlete, and a lettering team captain. I would love to be able to help all of you guys reach your full potential, and please vote me for ASB. Hello, my fellow Glenconians. I am Adam Sofeld, and I'm running for ASB. I'm running because I love this school, and I want to make it so we can get the most amount of time and fun out of high school. My plan for this is to make assemblies more fun and entertaining, and to bring back some of our old traditions, like the boy-girl dance and others. I also want to help make the dances more radical and tubular, and to just make our school better overall. Thank you, and Roll Tide! Hello, my name is Ryan Hall, and I'm running for ASB president. When I came to Glencoe as a freshman, I had a few friends and a lot of anxiety. I was still trying to figure out who I was. At the end of the year, I heard about student council elections, and I was interested in running. I was terrified to run, and a lot of the times I felt like I wanted to drop out. One of the biggest reasons that I didn't was that I had a friend who encouraged me and helped me through that process. Because of his influence in my life, I went on to be able to get the sophomore class president and ASB secretary. I want to be the same person that that friend was to me, which is why I'm running here today. I want to be able to support all Glencoe students in any activities that they are doing so that they can find themselves. If you have an idea like having a dodgeball tournament or a school barbecue, I want to give you the resources you need so that we can succeed. I also want to make sure that we include all Glencoe activities, both traditional and non-traditional, so that we can make Glencoe's year of 2017 the best year yet. I want to thank all of those who have decided to stand tall with me. For those of you who decided to stop crying when things got tough and made a difference here at Glencoe, and I ask for your help so that I can help make this year the best year possible. Unite us all. Vote for Hall. Good morning, Glencoe. My name is Emily Smith. We all know that Glencoe is already pretty great. I mean, where else can you find lockers painted just the right shade of tangerine, staircases that rise at a 90 degree angle, decorative industrial piping that serves absolutely no purpose, and a total of about four windows. But seriously, I've been a student at Glencoe for almost three years now, and I've found a lot to love about our school. Glencoe student spirit is the best in the district. We have an incredibly diverse student body, and many of our students have accomplished some pretty impressive things. I care about Glencoe, and I understand that sometimes it might feel like your voice isn't heard over the hundreds of other voices all sharing their opinions. I've been a part of student council since my freshman year, and I believe that student council needs to do a better job reaching out to you and molding events in the way that you want them. If elected, I intend to improve student outreach methods and do my best to make your experience at Glencoe the best that it can be. The Glencoe Student Council is all about serving and representing you, the students, and I promise that if you elect me, together we can make Glencoe even greater. Vote Emily Smith for ASB. Fellow students of Glencoe, my name is Jared Gaskin, and I'm ready to represent every one of you as a member of your ASB cabinet next year. Before I do, though, I'd like to address a problem regarding the representation of students in the leadership here at Glencoe. My experience as a student and member of the Student Council have led me to conclude that many voices at Glencoe, unfortunately, go unheard. It is my firm belief that the key to improving any aspect of our school is drawing from a larger and more diverse pool of ideas. For that reason, once elected, my goal will be to hear as many of your voices as possible. 
y no me importa el idioma que utilizan estas voces. Additionally, I encourage every one of you to run for student council this year, or apply for a position as a student senator. Make your voice heard. I want you to have the power to influence decisions that are being made in this school. So strengthen your voice in student government and vote for Jared Gaskin. My name's Ashley Finner, and I'm hoping that you will vote for me for ASB. I feel like I have a lot to offer for my junior year at Glencoe High School. I've already been in a full year of leadership, and I feel like that has prepared me for this position. I'm confident that the majority of you know me, and know how creative, reliable, determined, and especially capable of making Glencoe the best it can be for everybody in this school. But if you don't know me, I'm sure you've seen me. This could have been just around volunteering, this might have been at Glencoe events supporting, or just around the school spreading my positive, open, and spirited personality to those who surround me. But, like a good neighbor, I am always there. Vote Ashley Finner. What's up, Glencoe? My name is Caitlin Long, and as you can tell, I am running to be on next year's ASB. So, I've been in leadership since I was a freshman, and these past two years have given me valuable experience with planning and organizing Glencoe events. It's also given me knowledge of what a leader should be like. One thing that I've learned is that a leader should always have a vision that's achievable, but still bold. My vision for Glencoe is for us to bring our incredible spirit that we have at football games and siblings to all Glencoe events, from games to performances to club events. I want every member of Glencoe to feel included and supported, and I know that together we'll be able to achieve that. One other thing that I've learned is that a leader is always number two, and whoever they're serving is always number one. We spend hours of our lives here at Glencoe, so I want to make sure that these hours are enjoyable and memorable and meaningful. And I promise that on ASB, I will do whatever it takes to make your high school experience better, and I will listen to any ideas or suggestions you guys have, because if I'm on ASB, that makes you my number one priority. Thank you for listening, and remember to keep Glencoe strong and vote for Caitlin Long. Hi, I'm Tara, and I'm asking for your votes to help put me onto ASB next year. I've already been in leadership, and I understand the high demands and how it all works. My goal next year is to represent our diverse population more equally and to bring an improved experience to every student. I genuinely care about each person here at Glencoe, and as a member of ASB, I will do my best to reflect that through hard work and listening to what you want. With your input, we can make Glencoe a more fun and unified place. Please help me to help you make our school better. We can make a real difference here. You deserve to be heard and I can help you do it. Vote for me. Hey Glencoe, my name is Kelsey Daly and I'm running for ASB. I've been a part of Glencoe's leadership for about three years and I have really grown close to the school and everyone in it. I'm really excited to offer up my time and help make Glencoe a better place. ASB runs many events and one of my favorites is the canned food drive. This next year I will focus on encouraging the community and students to donate and to help feed the hungry and also help us get that win that we so clearly deserve. There are three qualities that are essential to have as an ASB member that I know that I possess. The first is dedication, second is a hard worker, and third is trustworthy. Throughout my three years in leadership, I have been a part of planning small events that happen in our school, putting, on lots of, putting lots of hard work into bigger events, and carrying out those events with lots of excitement. There's this quote that I really like, and it says, if anyone tells you your dreams are silly, remember, there's th there's some millionaire walking around who invented the pool noodle. Stay classy, Glencoe. Vote for daily. <laughs>